Scenes of clinicians meeting with patients. Clinical trials are critically important for advancing medical research and patient care. Z. Yong Lu, PhD, senior investigator, NLM. But one of the most significant challenges for clinical trial is about 40% of cancer trials failed due to insufficient patient enrollment. And this is because an identifying uh, eligible patient to a particular trial which has many inclusion and exclusion criteria is a very time-consuming and error-prone process. We've developed a special AI algorithm called Trial GPT, which is meant to speed up the process of matching patient to a relevant trial by harnessing the power of large language models. And in this particular case, we used ChatGPT. Harris S. Laudas, MD, Assistant Research Physician, NCI. Trial GPT is, a, is an implementation of a method wrapped around uh, a large language model which aims to perform matching of patients uh, to clinical trials. This assessment of eligibility is at the core of our workflow in, uh, for clinical trials at the National Cancer Institute and a lot of the additional institutes of the uh, National Institutes of Health. So, uh, Chao GPT is really designed to assist clinicians uh, instead of replacing them. Chao Jin, postdoc, NLM. So, for example, we did uh, a pilot study with our NCI collaborators, uh, where they basically conducted clinical trial matching with and uh, without Chao GPT. And we found that with Chao GPT, uh, these clinicians, they spent like 40% less time uh, in screening patients with the same accuracy. And this is really uh, very rewarding because we can save uh, them a lot of time and they can use the same time to conduct other uh, more important tasks like talking to the real patients. It basically performs a task that uh, a human could do by comparing a small bit of information against the question. So for example, is this patient's disease type appropriate according to this inclusion criterion? Yes, no, uh, unclear, require more information, something like that. So by performing this at each criterion level, inclusion and exclusion, we can have a detailed uh, assessment of the eligibility of a patient. In Child GPT, we really want to build something that is more transparent because we believe that more transparent it is, the more users would actually take it and use it. And we are developing something that not only can be published, but also make a real impact uh, to scientists, to clinicians, uh, to the general public. A white background with a gray and blue NIH, NLM logo.